Hey guys, it's Loveless, and welcome back to my reading on Danilo Cavalcante. In chapter 3, we explore and explain how the stars show his whereabouts. First, let's look at what the authorities have mentioned. We believe he is hiding somewhere locally and that he is alone. The U.S. Marshals are actively involved in this manhunt, District Attorney Deb Ryan said during a news conference Friday. Currently, we are looking everywhere in the area including railways, the Brandywine Creek and every area that may be a route out of Chester County. We have reason to believe he is heading south, end quote. We'll look at Danilo's planet, Mercury, for answers. Mercury is in Virgo, an Earth sign. Earth signs indicate places on the ground, under or near the pavement or floor, foliage, near mud or clay, or south. Virgo is what we call a mutable sign in astrology. Mutable signs indicate places near water, the eaves of houses, covered places, closets, antechambers and rooms within rooms. Danilo Calvacanti was spotted Tuesday evening in a creek bed, a place near water, mud, and clay. Virgo speaks of the direction south, tending towards southwest. The authorities are correct in their assertions. Virgo is also a humane sign, and said to indicate that the lost person perhaps will be found in a place frequented by people such as the home, rather than outside in a secluded area. Will he get tired of trudging around the woods, and eventually move towards homes? Lastly about Virgo, this sign is related to farming and agriculture, and objects or areas that serve a purely utilitarian purpose, places or things used to store, restore, or repair. He was spotted twice near Longwood Gardens, a botanical garden, which is southwest of Chester County Prison and spans 1,077 acres. We believe his planet as Mercury retrograde shows him returning to places he had been before, perhaps even lost and moving in circles, or maybe there is a method to his madness, and he finds the large area a good place to hide. Mercury is in an angular house, the fourth house. Angular houses shows him nearby of the search, and normally suggests a quick recovery. If Mercury wasn't retrograde, it would be quick. The fourth house represents homes in general, and Calvacanti was spotted on a resident's home security system Saturday, September 2nd. Indeed though, Mercury in the fourth house says he is still local, but the fourth house, like the twelfth house, is a house of hidden things. Local, but unable to be seen. And why? The Sun, another planet showing him hidden by virtue of being too close to Mercury in this chart, and the main reason of his secrecy, will explain. As the Sun rules the third house of local travels, he is unable to be found simply because he keeps moving through thick, changeable Virgo woods. He's spotted, authorities search the area, and he is unable to be found. Venus in the third house is a slight boon, in the sense that it shows secrecy in his local travels. It would also show him walking around the prison at some point, besides his escape. We wonder though, if this shows him ultimately, traveling back to prison? In any event, authorities stated they suspect he is trying to go, somehow, to his native Brazil, which is extremely south of Pennsylvania. Again, the chart agrees with the authorities. The fourth house is homelands, and Virgo again, is south. This is where he's trying to go. And lastly, regarding timing. Mercury in Virgo, in the fourth house, says he may not be captured for weeks, but Mercury being retrograde complicates timing. That's it for part three. In coming chapters, we look at the plausibility of his capture, his escape, and more.